Hi everybody, it's 3.22 in the afternoon and I haven't vlogged at all. Uh, I've had a busy morning. I woke up kind of late and went to work and now I'm back from work. Um, so obviously I still haven't gotten any reading done, but on the bright side, I have been listening to my audiobook and I found out that yes, my audiobook is actually the first book of this author, Tomi Adayemi. Her first book is The Children of Blood and Bone, and that is what I am listening to right now. I have about six hours left in it, and I'm very happy because that means that I can listen to it guilt-free and still complete one of the challenges, and then in the times that I can read, I can actually, you know, read the book. I am number four. <laughs> So yes, I have fallen far behind in my scheduled reading, but I still believe I can get all the challenges done. I still have time, and really as soon as I finish doing this little catch up, I'm going to create my Reading Nook video, and I will sit in that little Reading Nook and I will read. And uh, I'm gonna do that until I have something else that I need to do as well as taking the Instagram photo. Um, I do have another plan tonight. I do go to fencing uh, on Thursdays and Mondays that I don't work in the evenings, and I don't work this evening, so I'm going to go to fencing for two hours. I haven't gone in a while, and I feel really bad, but I love doing it, so I am gonna go to that. So really, until then, I am gonna create my reading book and read it. So I'll update you guys after that. I'm on page 142. It is currently 438. The lighting is horrible, but you know, we're gonna deal with that for the moment. But like I said, I'm on page 142 and this book is absolutely hilarious. Like this is literally just everything that Sean did in the show, but like given actual like reasoning for it and like how he gets away with so much stuff on the show and I love it so much and there are little inputs from Gus who is his best friend so this is Sean and this is Gus um, if you haven't watched the show and then there are also little inputs from Sean's in the TV show girlfriend in the movie fiance to wife kind of thing spoiler by the way that um, and it's really funny, and I'm having a lot of blast, and I'm reading it really quickly because it's easy to read, the font is big, there are lots of pictures and diagrams and whatnot. But yeah, so I'm about halfway through already, and I've been reading for an hour, maybe a little longer, I should have looked up to the start. But yeah, so I'm just going to keep reading this, and it's great. <laughs> This is my cat, Polly. She's older than I am. She's like 20, 21 years old. I'm only 19. And she can't hear anything. She's very grouchy. She's a little lost it. But yes. So, yeah. She's just so happy. So I'm going to sit here and complete the read one book in one spot challenge. I have Sykes Guide to the Crime Fighting for the Totally Unqualified. As soon as she settles, I'll, I'll take it. Um, and I'm gonna sit here and read it. I chose this spot in my house because this is my dad's chair. Like this is my dad's chair. He has listened to so many books in this chair and yeah, and it's been here for forever. This is actually the chair that I was sitting in, in middle school, 
that I read the Cat Warrior series in, and that's what made me love books in the first place. So it's a very, very special chair. Yes, come on. Oh, almost sat down. Um, so I decided that this would be where I read that book. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. Hi everyone. It is 11.04 p.m. I have come back from fencing and taken a shower and I edited and uploaded two videos and I'm very happy I did because I was just starting to get really stressed out about falling behind on that. So I uploaded days two and three of my vlogs and I also uploaded today's challenge video. I did that separate because I actually wanted to take part in like the competition aspect of it and I haven't done that with the previous three challenges but I would like to do that so depending on what the other ones are I might release them as oi, hey I might release them as separate videos or I might include them with this I don't know hopefully you guys are okay with me just gonna be spur of the moment if not I am sorry but yeah so my cat, Polly, has joined me once again for this reading adventure. Basically, whoever sits in this chair has to deal with her being on their lap because uh, she always has to be on someone's lap. But yeah, so I got the videos done, which means I haven't done a whole lot of reading, but that's what I'm about. That's exactly what I'm about to do right now. So, I've got my book. The one I'm reading in the same spot. I've read over just over half of it in this chair with this cat. We've both learned a lot. Thank you, Sean and Gus and Henry and Juliet and even a little bit of Lassiter. Um, but yeah, so I'm just gonna sit here and I'm not moving until I finish this book. So I better get started then so I can go to bed. Okay.